There was excitement all around Cumnock as His Royal Highness the Duke of Rossi visited Knockroon housing project. Locals came out in force to catch a glimpse of the Prince as he made his first formal visit to the site. Developer Anne Hope says the Prince's visit will help lift spirits in the area. I think a lot of local people um, who have been into the visitor centre um, have been really pleased to hear that someone like him is taking such an interest in their area. Um, because Cumnux maybe had a, a difficult time over the past few years with the decline of mining, um, I think they're, they're so pleased that uh, somebody of his standing is, is taking an interest in the local area. The project will see the development of 600 homes and business facilities. Prince Charles was eager to see how the plans are progressing on the site. Local businesses were heavily involved in the preparation for the Prince's visit. The foundation stone itself has been cut and lettered by a company from Auckland Lake and the curtains that will be used for the unveiling have been made by a company from Cumnock. So we're trying to keep things as local as possible. The Prince will no doubt be pleased to hear the project has attracted interest from across the globe. And even requests for brochures from places like Singapore and Auckland as well. So, um, but we're really pleased at how genuinely interested people are in the Croon. His Royal Highness also met University of Western Scotland engineering student Kimberly Mayer, who has helped with the development of the site. She was delighted to have met the Prince of Wales. Quite nerve wracking. It's nice though. I just said about how many years I've been doing civil engineering, how long is the course, and um, what did I do on site. Workers in the project were also greeted by the Prince and he took time to thank them for the hard work and continued effort. The Prince was delighted to unveil the project's first stone. I'm not saying anything because my voice is gone, I've got the dreaded leg. <laughs> <laughs> so what I should say is I have a great pleasure in unveiling this foundation stone.